I'm at the Osaka Station now. Today we are heading to Kyoto Station. Actually, Kyoto Station is a different prefecture, but uh, from Osaka Station, it only takes 30 minutes by train. Wow. Even it's a weekday, so many people here. So from Osaka to Kyoto, there are several ways to go there. The first option is going by Shinkansen, but obviously that's expensive. The second option is going by the Thunderbird. Well, it costs 1,230 Japanese yen. And the last option is taking a rapid train, which is 570 Japanese yen. Well, technically, Thunderbird is faster, but it takes 27 minutes, but the regular rapid train takes only 29 minutes. The price is almost half, so I strongly recommend to take a rapid train. For the next train, from 1.45. That special rapid train leaving from truck number 8, so this is the way. Well, I totally understand that time is important, but you know, 2 to 3 minutes saving 500 Japanese yen? Definitely. You would better save it. Let me teach you guys Japan travel tip. Seems like no seed, but you can always find a seed like this. So, if you can't find a seed, here we go. Alright, here we go. We arrived to Kyoto. It was really quick. Oh, by the way, hey guys, welcome to Ryan's TV. I'm Ryan Sedoko. Please don't forget to check my Instagram and Twitter account. This place is a bit noisy, so let's get out from this station first. Oh, sweet. That's the main entrance of Kyoto Station. Now feels like I arrived to Kyoto. Yep, whenever I come, I feel the same thing. It's a really beautiful station. So today, we'll be staying at one of the most expensive hotels in Kyoto, Park Hyatt. Well, definitely a hotel is too expensive for me, but one of my generous Patreon invite me there. So, arigato! It's my first time to stay there, so I'm super excited. Yes, super happy. But before checking, the hotel is located right next to Kiyomi's Temple. Kiyomi's Temple becomes really beautiful with Sakura. So, why not? Let's visit Kiyomi's temple first. So, let's keep walking. Let's go. So, right now, we are there at Kyoto Station. And Kiyomi's temple is the east side. So, let's take a bus. In Kyoto, there are subways, but the simplest way to get to Kiyomi's temple by bus. So, it seems like I have to take this Shie Yong, which is that one over there. So. Let's go. By the way, they have a one day pass too. Price is 700 Japanese yen. So I think if you use the bus, you know, more than four times, uh, definitely you should get the one day pass. You can buy it at the vending machine. And here we go. So that's the bus that I have to take. Oh, seems like many people are waiting. So it takes about 10 minutes from here to the next stop. So from here, change it to the next pass. Wow, beautiful sky. Love the weather. So the next bus stop, it must be there. Oh, must be this one. Let's go. Oh my goodness, look at the sakura. On the river side, really beautiful. So we arrived to the closest bus stop. From here, we have to walk to the Kiyomi's temple. So from bus stop, we have to walk a while. Let's keep walking. Even you have no idea how to get to Kiyomi's Zera, don't worry about it because there are many signs like this in many languages. So, let's go. In Kyoto, there are many rental kimono stores like this. So if you want to take a photo with kimono, you can always rent. The price starting from 3,000 Japanese yen. And also, they can keep your staff. You don't have to make a reservation. <laughs> and a student discount as well. 
ナイス Oh my goodness, it's too hot. Let me get water. <sighs> Here, it's really hot. Today, 22 degrees. Yeah, feels like already summer has came. Ah, water. Loving it. Oh, so Kiyomi's tempo is almost there, so let's keep walking. Let's go. Yes, it's almost there. Almost. Well, last time when I visited Kiyomi's tempo, it was in the middle of the pandemic, so that was like empty, like really quiet Kiyomi's tempo, but Today, it's totally different. There are many people here. Wow, look at that. With Sakura, really beautiful. <laughs> look at there. That's a photo spot. Many people try to take a photo in front of Sakura with kimono. Yep, looks like Japan. Loving it. Oh my goodness, look at the view from here. Wow. Well, actually, we will go up higher, so it will be more beautiful. Let's keep walking. Oh, look at this place. It looks like the place from Kimetsu no Yaiba anime. Well, actually, that was a Fuji, which is a different flower. But uh, yeah, really nice. And from here, we can have a better view. Yep, because this place is much higher. So actually, that was a place that many people were taking photo of downstairs. And then this is the upstairs, so we can see the town more. Well, I missed this place about two years ago during the pandemic. I visit here and I was eating onigiri and they told me that we can't eat here later. So be careful. Inside the temple area, you can't eat. Yep. So here you can buy the ticket. The price is 400 Japanese yen for adult, 200 Japanese yen for kids. They usually close at the 6 p.m. So yeah, make sure visit here before that. And here we go. This is how the ticket looks like. So, let's enter the Kiyomi Temple. Let's go. Let's enter the Kiyomi Temple. Wow, can you believe that? Actually, this temple was built in 778, which is about 1,200 years ago. This place was repaired and also rebuilt, but still, Amazing construction, really nice. And this is the most popular place in Kiyomi's temple, Kiyomi's no Butai, meaning stage of Kiyomi's temple. As you can see, this stage is really high. <laughs> yeah, really scary. We have a saying that Kiyomizu no butai kara tobi oriru, meaning jumping from the stage of Kiyomizu. Well, meaning that something you do with strong determination. Yeah, that's a really popular saying in Japanese. So, remember it if you have visited Kiyomizu temple. Well, before coming over here, I was like, well, it doesn't make sense much, but after see this place, Oh yeah, totally makes sense. Actually from there, we can see the Mori. So, let's go there. And this is an, another really popular picture spot. As you can see, so many people are taking photo from here. Yep, you can take beautiful photo.
Oh, I know this is like nothing compared to before the pandemic. However, already we got used to it with the super few people in the town at the sightseeing place as well. But definitely the situation is getting back to normal. So I have to get used to it. Yep. <laughs> Anyway, so this is how the situation in Japan right now. Even in the weekday, there are already many people coming back to the town. And this place as well, people are back. There is a line. Yep, again, it's a weekday. Oh, look at this lake. <laughs> With sakura, really beautiful. Even the water. It's not really beautiful. However, with Sakura, really beautiful. <laughs> and now we came back to the main street. Well, it's a little bit hard to take a photo, but uh, yeah, definitely it's better because I love to feel the people's excitement and the happiness. Yeah. That's how the travel spot should be, right? That's what I love. Anyway, so from here to the hotel, it's about eight minutes walking, which is not that far, so let's keep walking. Let's go. <laughs> oh my goodness, look at those stores. So many cats. And also, there is a big one in cat as well. So, seems like this is the way to go. Okay, seems like my hotel is near from here, but uh, I don't see hotel at all. Oh, uh, well, let's see. Oh, wait. I see. So that's the hotel. Well, it doesn't look like a Hyatt hotel at all, but uh, oh yeah, Kyoto Hotel. That's the street of Kyoto, and this is the Hyatt. Wow. Interesting. So let's check in. Really nice. Wow. Huh. Well, it's totally different than what I told. You know, it's a Hyatt, but seems like that's a. Looks like a Japanese house. Nice. So he will read me to the reception. So he told me that there is a cam and then that one can check the body temperature. Hmm. Nice. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This is totally different level. Even I have a welcome strawberry and it smells so good. <laughs> By the way, when I see this glass, I remember the Beauty and the Beast. Anyway, let me show you guys how the room looks like. Oh my goodness. Let's do it. So let's do the room tour. So here, this is the living room. Yes, actually living room is bigger than the business hotel usually I stay. And welcome strawberry. Sweet. Well, you think this room is dark? Don't worry about it. Let me make it brighter. So <laughs> here's the bottom. Well, actually this room comes with the private yard. <laughs> Can you believe that? I can't. And here, this is the mini bar. Oh my goodness. There are alcohol and also water plus coffee machine. And here, there are many different kinds of beer, wines, and also tea set. Those coffee are complimentary. That's what I heard. <laughs> and if you love wine, there are wine as well. 
So basically, water and the coffees are complementary. But other than that, you have to pay. Well, here is the price range. Coca-Cola costs 800 Japanese yen. That's the price range here. So now, let's go to check the yard. Okay, I can pull it and open. Wow. Oops. <laughs> oh my goodness. So that's the yard. You can enjoy. Wow. Even we have small fountain in the yard. Nice. Alright, let's keep making the room tour. However, there is a welcome champagne at the lobby. I want to try that. It's open until 6 p.m. So why don't we get the champagne first and we can come back. Let's do it. So let's go. So let's go get the welcome champagne. Let's go. By the way, this is the aisle. Yep. Really quiet and really fancy. Really nice atmosphere too. And here we go. Uh, it's at the lobby, so let me see. So I couldn't show you guys, but this is the lobby. Really nice. Wow, really nice atmosphere. Nice. Ah, sorry. Ah, sorry. Thank you. Oh my goodness, feels like that I become a VIP. Well, usually I make kampai with beer, but today, why not? Let's make kampai with champagne. So, kampai. Psycho. Also, they gave me a nuts. Mechoshu. Hmm. Well, it perfectly matches with champagne. Loving it. Alright, first one is done. Let's be welcome the second times. Yeah, why not? Let's keep walking. Alright, sweet. The second round. Come back. <sighs> Loving it. Alright, came back to the room. Let me give you guys the other part of the room tour. But beforehand, let me have the welcome Ichigo. Oh my goodness, look at this big strawberry. Mmm, mejaoji. By the way, strawberry in Japanese is Ichigo. Ichigo. Alright, so let's do it. So here. This is the main bedroom. Wow. It's huge. And also, there is a huge TV. Over here, we have a huge TV as well. But, uh, <laughs> here too, huge TV. So here, this is the uh, in-room dining. Oh, actually this plan includes the breakfast, the Japanese one. Oh my goodness, really? 7,150 Japanese yen. <laughs> Seems like we will have a really nice breakfast. Of course, I will be filming it, so please look forward to it. And what is this book? It's a North America Butterfly. Oh. 
Okay. You can learn many different kinds of butterfly. Interesting. And <laughs> let me show you guys the bathroom. This is the bathroom. Hello. And this is the bathtub. Wow. Actually, it's huge. Very nice. Let me check the water pressure. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh my goodness. There is a shower on top as well. And this is the shower on top. And this is the hand shower. Okay. Needless to say, water pressure, perfect. Wow, there are many different kinds of shower. Nice. <laughs> but uh, I haven't got used to this kind of room, so... Hmm, interesting. Loving it. And there is the bath lobe. And here. There is something that you can get it for free. Oh, interesting. There is a cup noodle. Actually, you can have a free cup noodle. Behind, that's the English menu. And here. That's amenities. The toothbrush, towel, and a comb. Also, those are the shaving foam. And here. <laughs> dryer the Dyson one I know this one is pretty nice sweet seems like we still have more what we have oh okay so this is a closet area walk-in closet and what is this oh okay safety bank plus what is this? Oh, maybe this one is a shoe dryer. And... Oh, that's the restroom. Wait. <laughs> well, it's automatically open. I was surprised. As you guys know, Japanese bathroom, really high tech. And then that one as well. Nice. Oh wait, it's almost the time of the sunset. There is a really nice sunset spot near here. So I wanna show you guys the beautiful sunset. So let's get there. But before going there, let me have one more strawberry. Hmm. Okay, so let's go. All right, outside gets darker, so we should be hurry. Well, it only takes about four minutes, so it shouldn't be far. Yeah, as you see, outside already, the time of the sunset, so let's go. Oh, yeah, 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 that one over there. So let's keep walking. Oh my goodness, look at this street atmosphere. Wow. Well, even I was born and raised in Japan, I feel Japan down. <laughs> well, that's why even Japanese people love Kyoto. Anyway, it's almost there, so let's keep walking. Yes, this is the photo spot. As you can see, so many people already stand by here. Yes. Wow, it's amazing, especially with Sakura. Beautiful. Well, as you see, there are many photographers here, so I don't want to disturb them. Let me take the time lapse in here. Well, I was planning to set the camera over here, but uh, since this angle is not that good, so I decided to pause it over here. I think this place 
it would be a nice time lapse. Oh my goodness, look at the sky. Wow, really beautiful. The sunset was really beautiful. Also, I could take beautiful photos. Please don't forget to check my Instagram account too. Outside gets pretty dark. This place becomes really quiet too, so let's go back to the hotel. Wow, this street gets totally dark. And then now, we have more nice atmosphere of Kyoto. It's 7 p.m. now. Almost all the stores are closed. Oh, look at that. On the way, I didn't realize, but uh, that's a uh, Sento Chihiro no Kamikakushi, which is a spirited away. Nice. Yep, this anime perfectly matches with Kyoto. And we came back to the hotel. It's really close from Kiyomi's temple and also that hill. All right now, so let's go to eat. Actually, there are several restaurants. The most expensive one is really fancy, but it costs fortune as you can imagine. So let's go to the medium one. It must be pretty nice too, so. Let's go to eat. Goodness, look at this area. Nice. So seems like here, it's Kyoto Bistro. Let's eat here. So those are the menu items. They have different kinds of stuff from sandwiches to steak. Well, you know, since I'm in Kyoto, I want to eat something like Japanese. And uh, look at this. They have a Kyoto Bistro Wagyu beef curry rice. 2420 Japanese yen. Yeah, this looks good. Why not? Let's order this. Ah, so sorry. Thank you. Hi, so sorry. Thank you. Oh my goodness, look at this. Wow. Yeah, I can tell. That's different. And it smells incredibly good as well. Loving it. <laughs> so again, the price is 2,420 Japanese yen. So I was thinking a bit bigger one, but uh, yeah, you know, the important thing is the quality. So let me try that. Itadakimasu. So inside, there is a Wagyu. Mm, it must be good. Oh my goodness, look at that. Itadakimasu. Well, the beef tender has a really sweet, nice flavor, and then the curry is not that sweet. It's kind of a spicy. Well, for me, I think it's just perfect. Loving it. Well, of course, I don't expect that they will serve some bad quality food here, but uh, yeah. <laughs> really nice atmosphere with really nice food. I really enjoyed it. Mm. Psycho. Also, there are some veggies. There is onion and carrots. I think we should mix it here. Mm. <laughs> really little veggies, but uh, maybe this is good enough amount for this curry. Itadakimasu. I thought that's a regular veggies, but it's a pickled veggie, so it's kind of sour. Well, spicy curry with sour veggies perfectly matches. I didn't know that. Uh, yeah. By the way, pickled veggie in Japanese is called tsukemono. Tsukemono. Yeah. So I think that's a kind of tsukemono style. So how about the onions? Hmm. Well, the onion. It's not spicy, but again, it's a pickled veggie, so perfect. Hmm, loving it. 
Ooh, that was really good. Compared to other kind of curry, maybe a little bit spicy. However, the wagyu was so tender and then perfectly matches with pickled veggies. Loving it. Maybe one of the best curry recently I had. Anyway, I reserved the bath, so let's go back to the room. Let's go. Ooh. Oh my goodness, what a big bed. <laughs> So in this room, there is a really nice bathtub. However, this place has onsen too, and I want to check that. I made a reservation. Well, unfortunately, I can't film it because it's a public bath, but I will tell you guys how good it is, or maybe it's not that good. Let me see. So see you guys soon. Ooh, so just went to the bath house. It was really nice. There are two mid-sized bus staff and also two steam rooms. Well, actually, you have to make a reservation to enter because, you know, due to the pandemic. So there is a 90 minute slot. There are three people made a reservation. When I went there, it was only me. So it's really nice. After that, the other guy came to that place. Uh, well, you know, the situation. So it was kind of awkward. <laughs> <laughs> but it was pretty good. So now let's go to workout. Yes, there is a gym. Let's do it. But beforehand, yeah. <laughs> Let me eat the strawberry. Mm. All right, so never mind. Let's go to workout. Let's go. Let's be bow. So this is the fitness center. Oh, you know what? Actually, on the treadmill, you can watch YouTube and Netflix plus TV. Let me see. Wow, so many languages. Okay, so weather news, exercise, TV, YouTube, Netflix, weather too. Hmm, seems like tomorrow is a sunny day. Sweet. And here you can do weight training. Well, as you can realize that my body is kind of skinny, so I want to be bigger, especially before the summer. So I've been working out recently. Please look forward to it. Let me see if I can still do the one hand push up. Let me see. I think only several times and no more, it's too hard. <laughs> By the way, there is a free water in the gym too. So I want to take a bus again. Taking the bus in the hotel, it's my guilty pleasure. Let me... Oh, you know what? Look at that! The water coming from there! Nice! Well, as you guys know, Japanese love to take a bath in the bathtub. And so I am. So, see you guys soon. Ooh, that was a nice bath. Actually, I just checked the price on this room tonight on Expedia. The price is over 170,000 Japanese yen. Wow. Well, they told me that they booked this hotel with the point, but uh, still, that's a lot to me. Again, thank you so much. Well, without you guys' support, totally this place out of my budget. <laughs> Arigato. Anyway, this stay is really relaxing and wonderful experience, but at the same time, it's really inspiring as well. You know, this trip reminds me again that who I want to be like. I want to be like the people who are willing to give to other people. Well, I have not so much to give, but at least I can make a video. So if my video can give you a small entertainment or joy, it really means to me a lot and I'm super happy. Yeah. Well, in the future, hopefully I can be the person who can give more and more. Yeah, I really hope so. 
Anyway, so tomorrow we have a nice breakfast in this hotel and also we will try to look for the Kyoto street food as well. Please look forward to it. Big thank you to all of the Patreons because of you guys' support, I can keep traveling. If you haven't, please don't forget to check my Patreon account. Arigato! And also, if you haven't, don't be shy. Please subscribe and join the adventure. And if you haven't, please hit the like button on this video if you enjoyed it. Arigato! Alright, so see you on the next video. See the go! <laughs> Have a great day. Bye bye. Well, I don't think I can drink 800 Japanese yen coke yet. Yeah. When the time comes, I will. But uh, I think not yet. So until then, 150 Japanese yen drink, kanpai. <laughs> okay, so see you in the next video. Bye-bye.